unalienable means that no government has the power to take away or to even grant those rights. They are already ours, inherent as a human being created by God. Where does power come from? This is the first principles. This is what the question that the founders asked in the beginning. Where does power come from? Does it come from the divine right of kings? Or does it come from military might? No. Thomas Paine, he wrote Common Sense and he said he lambasted the idea of creating two separate classes of people. The one called royalty and the one called the common person. No. Another Thomas, Thomas Jefferson, wrote the Declaration of Independence that all people are created equal, created with unalienable rights. From where? From God. So this is the first principles. Where does power come from? Where does our rights and liberties come from? Not from unalienable means that no government has the power to take away or to even grant those rights. They are already ours, inherent as a human being created by God. This is the first principles that we talk about that the founders established this nation on. And that's what we're talking about here. Going back to first principles, it's clear that our rights and liberties come from God the Creator. And this is what we must uphold in America. This is what I'm doing here on these videos. And I ask you to join me. So go make it a great day and let's keep America awesome. All right, let's do it. See you soon.